Howdy do. Howdy. Howdy do. Yeah, sometimes those emotes can be a little fussy. Um, so I have a stream deck and I've actually uh, uh, keep buying those uh, into the stream deck. So. That is not as strange. He did tell me as well that he was thinking of working at her establishment. Yes. Let me see here. Oh. Right. Maybe he's... Oh, he's... He's thinking. Can I get you anything behind the bar, sugar? A little food, a little drink? Oh, how'd it do? Uh, I was looking for my niece. I uh, heard she might be in town, and I figured I'd swing by and say... Hi, Tour. Oh, all right. Who's your niece? Uh, Melissa. Melissa. Does she live here? I've not met a Melissa yet. Uh, the telegram said that she arrived yesterday. Uh, so I thought I'd swing by and see if she's in town. Yeah. Mr. Lawless, have you met a Melissa? I have not, unfortunately, sir. Uh, Melissa Thorne, I think the... Uh, but, uh, if you do know her, uh, she, she tells a lot of chicken jokes. Oh, Melissa really? Thorne, the chicken joke girl. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Sounds oh. delightful. Mm. Uh, name's Eustace. Eustace Dustin Eustace. Lovely to meet you, Eustace. I'm Dorothy. My friends call me Doe. Over there is Mr. Mr. Lawless. He's, he's a lawyer here in town. Oh, how'd he do? How do you do, sir? Nice to meet you. Eustace, was it? Uh, Eustace, yes. Hey, very nice to meet you, yes. Uh, myself and my business associate, partner, Mr. Clueless, we run the local law firm, uh, Lawless and Clueless. Should you need anything? Uh, criminal, civil, uh, private and business affairs? Oh. Welcome, welcome. Mm, yes. They're very good at what they do. Indeed. Hopefully, your uh, young niece with the chicken jokes hasn't succumbed to any foul play. Oh, I love what you did there. That, that was very good. Mm. Oh, you should stick around. He, <laughs> he is very quick with those. Thanks uh, for all the gift subs. Uh, do you reside around these parts, sir? Uh, actually, I live down in St. Denis uh, with my wife. Uh, we've been married over 50 years. Oh, goodness. Congratulations, sir. Yeah, her name's Elvani. Elvani Destenberg. I see. Goodness. Uh, so, uh, had, had any interesting cases lately? Ah, oh, yes, things are certainly starting to hot up on several fronts, actually. We're supporting the local newspaper business as well as a mining corporation uh, in the, uh, some business dealings they're having together. Uh, and I was reacquainted uh, uh, just two days ago with an old client of ours, uh, and he and his family are resettling back into the area. And uh, it was a very lucrative, if uh, somewhat complicated uh, arrangements. I'm looking forward to some furtherment there too. Uh, but yes, people have been reaching out to us for a number of different uh, uh, matters. Uh, a lot of business dealings, uh, thankfully. Some unions starting up in the air, looking out for the various uh, needs of the workforce. Well, that's delightful. Uh, it seems like business is booming. Yes, certainly getting there, sir. What about yourself, sir? What is uh, your line of work, if you still practice? Oh, I'm, I'm kind of a retired uh, 
um, tram driver at the moment. Oh, I see. Uh, but yeah, my uh, wife, uh, uh, she would sit with me on the tram and we would tell haunted tram tours. Oh, oh, that sounds quite remarkable. Haunted tram tours. Mm hmm. Uh, hopefully, uh, they'll come out of strike and I can get my old job back. Oh, well, I hope so too. If you need any legal uh, advice uh, in such matters, do feel free to reach out to us, uh, even for a free consultation. We'd be happy to help you if we can. Well, thank you. Ooh, uh, free coffee. Uh, that, that was mighty kind of you. Thank you so much for the coffee. Oh, you're welcome. There's a splash of bourbon in there to warm your soul. Um, uh, it's starting to get daybreak. Uh, is the pancakes ready yet? Oh, well, it's unfortunate, but we are plumb out of pancakes. Mr. Clueless actually bought us out yesterday. What? I know, he bought all of them. <laughs> he bought all of them. Well, well, I mean, we have been waiting two weeks for that pancake delivery, so... I know. A week and a half, I, should, so I shouldn't exaggerate. Yeah. Well, he happens. came in and he said, I'm taking them all, Miss Doe. Yeah, I've, I've heard uh, you got to place your order at least uh, weeks or months or years in advance for those pancakes. <laughs> yes, yeah, certainly. There was some uh, joviality in a conversation with young Willard in Pawpaw uh, about a week and a half back, saying that if we ordered on a Thursday, perhaps the pancakes would be ready in time for the weekend. And there was lots of rebuttals and uh, refuting of these allegations. And here we are a week and a half later, and they only just made it in for the Friday just past. Oh my goodness. Well, hopefully we can get them more often. Yeah, no wonder Dicky Boy is so uh, laid up today if he's been stuffing his face all night. He probably smoked himself almost senseless, and he's been stuffing his face on munchy pancakes all through the night. I believe it. Mm. I might believe even he's be up there right now eating them. Probably, yes. He's probably... Uh, Wait, he, he's eating he, the prophets? I mean, I'm that, that the would, uh, that's typical of him, yeah. He's probably had so many pancakes that he's just uh, flat that's out really somewhere. Prior scepter. Hope you're doing well. In fact, I'm going to go and check out office. I'll be back shortly, Dorothy. Nice to All meet right. you again, Mr. Dustenberg. Uh, pleasure meeting you as well. Uh, safe travels to you. Thank you. I shan't be too long. See you soon. All right. And um, uh, Doe, is that right? Mm hmm. Uh, your name, uh, uh, Dorothy, but you shortened it to. Uh, to Doe. Mm hmm. To Doe, okay. Uh, do you have any need for uh, maybe 76 uh, bags of sugar? Oh, goodness. Mm, let me check. I don't think we're buying sugar at the moment. Let me see here. Oh, goodness. No, we got quite a bit of sugar, but um, if you have any eggs or lemons or grain, I believe. Let me check. I think grain. Let's see here. Where are we at with grain? Yeah, mm -hmm. eggs or lemons or grains. Uh, okay, uh, I've been working in the sugar fields and uh, I actually have 76 uh, bags on me, so I just wanted to make sure uh, if you needed them or not. Oh, I don't, but Granny Sue is opening her bakery just across the street today, and I'd imagine she probably needs an awful lot of sugar. Okay, I'll check over there. Yeah, I don't think she's awake just yet, but she might have a telegram number on the, uh, maybe like the shop window or something, and you could ride her and set up a time. Oh, okay. Yeah, definitely. Um, I never know how many I have in my pocket, uh, uh, so, but it's, it's always good to have. Mm -hmm. Yep, and I'm sure, you know, I'm sure she could use it, because, uh, yeah, there's, there's a fair here tonight as well. Ooh, a fair. Uh, are, are they going to be mm -hmm. serving those caramel uh, 
uh, uh, uh, carrots like they did last time during the fall season. Oh goodness, I hope so. Um, I don't know. We'll. I don't think we'll be providing them, but maybe Granny Sue will or Miss Josephine, who owns the cafe on the corner. Oh. Well, uh, Blackwater is just a growing. Uh, oh gosh, it is. Uh, so yeah, uh, you you've been here long. Um, about oh goodness, like four or five days. I'm I've been working here. Mm-hmm. Well, it's, it's good to see uh, good faces around town. Of course, I hope I hope you and your your wife and your your niece. You said, mm-hmm, Melissa. Melissa, right. I hope you guys are around more often. Does she is she planning on settling here, or is she going back to Saint Denis with you? Uh, she, I think she kind of favors Blackwater some. Uh, Saint Denis is not m- much of her style, but I did want to check in on her, make sure she's doing all right. Oh, good. So does that mean we'll be seeing you and your wife down here more often? Uh, we we pass through sometimes. We go over to the farm over there and get some carrots for the horses. Oh, what do they call that? Little Hope? Little Hope Ranch? Uh, yeah, I think so. Mm. Uh, yeah, it's quite the popular place. Mm-hmm. Uh, the strawberries are so popular that they can't let them grow f- tall enough to, uh, to, p- to pick them. Now you have to pick them in the ground. Goodness, I know. I've seen people down there just scooping them up, digging up those, those little dirt mounds, trying to find any semblance of a berry. Oh, yeah. Those, the, those berries are delicious. Uh, do you have any recipes uh, for uh, strawberries? Oh, I don't. Um, but I think Granny Sue might. I heard someone's been trying to work on strawberry jam. Ooh, that sounds delightful. That's what I was wondering. Uh, strawberry jam. Put that little bit on toast. Mmm, that is delicious. Oh, it does sound amazing, doesn't it? Mm-hmm. And if we ever get those... Uh, pancakes you put a little maple syrup on the pancakes and put uh, some fresh berries on the side oh that's good too oh that does oh you're making my mouth water mr eustace mm, yeah but um yeah uh, just kind of doing a little odd jobs here and there and uh, making a living the best way i can and hopefully i get my tram job back i never know Goodness, I hope so. Well, if you ever run across any eggs or lemons, we are always buying those, I think. I haven't come across a lemon tree. I found an orange tree. Uh, It does pretty good. Oh, well, I think Granny Sue might buy oranges because I know someone told me she's got a recipe for candied orange. Oh, that sounds interesting. Mm Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, so maybe you, when you write her, if her telegram number's over there, I'd imagine it is, but you could tell her you got all sorts of things that she might want. Mm-hmm. And uh, my wife, uh, uh, Elvini, she she does uh, the tarot card readings. Oh, goodness, really? Mm-hmm. See, I've seen in the newspaper there's some woman over that manor that does that as well, but... The stars, that's so far away. Next time you bring her down here, please ask her to bring her cards. I'd love a reading. Oh, yeah. I mean, we were here probably about a week and a half ago. And uh, what was it? Papa uh, and May? Oh, uh, yes. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. We, we gave a tarot card reading to them. And uh, they oh. just loved it. They, they said uh, we're always welcome here. Of course. Goodness. I would love a reading. Oh, well, I hope you guys come down to the fair today and maybe, oh, maybe you could set up a table at the fair. Mm, uh, we'll have to say, uh, uh, might be a, a during some nightmares. I'm not sure. Oh, uh, well, all right. Yeah, I think the lady organizing the fair, she said it's at uh, 7 p.m. under the Eastern Stars. Oh, okay. I'll keep that in mind. Oh, goodness, yeah. We'd love to have you, I'm sure. Well, thank you so much. Uh, I think I'll probably head on over to the farm. I'm not seeing Melissa here, so... All right. Well, if I see this Melissa come in, I'll point her in the direction of the, the ranch. Okay. 
Thank you so much, and you have a of wonderful course. morning. Thank you. You too, Mr. Dustenberg.